Hi everybody, I have another Dig, Discover, and Display project to share with you guys today. This one is called Egyptian Relics and we picked it up from RainbowResource.com. I do like to keep the packaging so that if we do this project again in the future, I know which kit to buy. So this one comes with an excavation block, some directions, and of course your excavation tool and brush, as well as some paint if you decide to paint your sarcophagus. So this material happened to be quite soft, in fact softer than some of the other excavation blocks that we've done before in the past and so this one is a really good kit to use with young kids. My five-year-old worked at this and she had a really easy time finding the pieces inside. And what's really neat about this particular kit is that the pieces come fully intact except for the sarcophagus which only comes in two pieces. So after we had excavated it with it just being dry, we did add a little bit of water to this, but it didn't really make it all that much easier, but it did make it a little bit messier. So this one happened to be just a really soft material that if you wanted to skip adding water to it, you totally could. Okay, so my older son decided to use some of the tools from another excavation kit, but it's not always a good idea to do this because you could damage some of the pieces that you're trying to uncover. Okay, so one of the sarcophaguses that we got was a clay color while the other one was a white color. We just ordered two of them and they just happened to be different even though they were both the same kit and we decided not to paint ours because we really liked the natural color a lot better. So if you want to catch up on some of the other projects we've done for our ancient Egyptian unit study you can click here to see those videos as well as how I put together our ancient Egypt unit study and if you'd like to see more pictures you can see them on Instagram at Pepper and Pine. Thanks for watching.